Okay, you know what? Let's do another episode of the game. Why? Because I'm enjoying it. Another episode. The Battle of Sanikovland. Sanikovland. I don't know how you say it. I flew from the whale's blowhole like a supersonic jet. And below me the ocean became a sheltered bay studded with white shapes. You will be amazed uh -oh. as my epic journey unfolds. For here, it was about to take a most unexpected turn. And it happened like this. Ow. <laughs> that hurts your face. In my personal opinion. Ooh, ouchie, we are in ouchiness. Otherwise known as pain. I can't tell if I'm gonna sneeze or not. False alarm. Wow. It's a friend. It's a beautiful but deadly wasteland. A freezing cold. Brutally chilly. Enough to kill a man in hours. Yet here you are. Indeed, General. An impoverished mm. childhood playing in the streets of Omsk during those bitter winters had made me hardy. I thought you said you grew up in Altai. Ah, General, the life of a poor toy maker's family. We had to move from place to place just to find work. Whales! No, they're not whales. <laughs> Walruses! <laughs> I know my animals. I'm excellent at biology, thank you very much. Meep. I've decided they're all named Bob. Fun. My only complaint so far with this game is sometimes it doesn't really register when you press the buttons. Hi! Oh no, that was mean! I'm sorry, baby. I thought I was just gonna have to climb on it and like jump over you. That was so mean. He was just hanging around, you know? He was having a good time. They're so cute, but so big. Oh, um, question. Hello? What would you like from me, good sir? Ow. Is there an ice block somewhere? Oh wait, or can I go over here? No. Yeah, I can't get up there, can I? Hmm. Let me study. Bonk. No. I am a little confusion. If I jump on it, will it just send him flying? Because that would be fun. Oh no, wait. I jump up there. I am smart. I got the big brain. My brain is so wrinkly. Like, you guys just don't give me enough respect for how wrinkly my brain really is. Feels mean. <laughs> no, he was just having his own little good time. Oh, I feel like a horrible human being. R.A.P. 
Bob is what I've called him. R.A.P. Bob. Is he on like a seesaw? That's cute! They have a seesaw! It's a war seesaw! Even he's clapping for him like, yay! Seesaw! I just think that's adorable and I'm in love. Oh, I reckon I have to like run under. Okay, 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 I got this. I got this. Don't crush my skull, please. Thank you. I enjoy keeping my skull intact. This convenient structure. Those are like giant tusks, and that's terrifying. Sonic we don't know everything's Lair. bigger than us, eh? but yeah. Of course, Sonikov himself reported nothing more than a bluish fog on the horizon. Your island may be nothing more than the product of overactive imaginations. General, consider this. Imagine taking a simple peasant, a pig shepherd, for example, and telling him one day humans would fly around the earth beyond the sky. He would say you were stark raving mad, saldafon, a ridiculous kaziol baradati, a buffoon stuffed into a military uniform, a pridurak, a chuchula tu parila. I like this the fact that they throw in actual Russian. Better watch his mouth if he doesn't want to spend his holidays in Salavietsky. Perhaps you should return to your store. I just love the whole way they've sorted this game out, like the narration and everything. It's great. <laughs> Just about, I forgot what the shift button was. <laughs> not good. I have to give this yeah, keyboard back soon as well. I could not believe it. A it hairy is elephant a giant. trapped and frozen in the ice. A mammoth. No, General, a hairy elephant. Who would think such a thing could be? Yeah, a hairy elephant is also an accurate description, to be fair. I would love to do the art for a game like this. That would be like the dream. Or just any game, to be honest. Spin, 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 spin around, spin around, spin around. Hmm. I miss our dinosaur friends. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you need to go watch the first episode on my YouTube. Spit. Uh, hello, game crash, come back. How I managed to make that despite it crashing, not sure. I'll take it though. I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. I'll look them in the eye. Who set up this whole rig? That's I my question. Onwards through the blizzard, one foot grimly in front of the other. Blinded by the snow, my nose becoming quite blue. My thoughts of home crushed under the weight of the plummeting temperature. I am bored, Ivan Ivanovich, and sick to my teeth of listening to this rush. I'm not. Let us speak plainly now. You will tell me 
where my bomb is. Oh, I can't jump. Interesting. Or I will have you shot. Fun. I will tell you. Or will I? Russian roulette. I am just getting to that, General. Shot! Comrade Primal. <laughs> shot with real bullets. Fired from a real gun, not some ludicrous bulltavia about the uh, lost cities and dinosaurs and mink and mammoth. That was a hairy elephant. No! I will not <laughs> no. tolerate any more! Where is the bomb, Ivan Ivanovich? I feel like this is me talking Where to Nick. Little Orpheus. him like talking nothing. to me, he's like, just give me the poison. I'm like, no, but have you considered I the hairy elephant? I realized it must be. Where? There? On Sunnycliffe land? Yes, General. Because as the storm began to clear, I realized with a strange excitement and trepidation that I was not alone on Sunnycliffe land. That would make me scared. Ooh. Just had a little bit of a yawn there. Apologies. Been having some very late nights lately. Bonk! Oh. Yeah, who set all this up? That's such an uncomfortable sound. Wait, Doesn't sound wait, anything wait. like him. Go back. You say these lifeboats came from Zaria. A Russian ship? Zarya returned home, but not with all of her crew. And here were the missing lifeboats, trapped in the ice for all of these years. That and it could only mean one thing. That you are continuing to hang lapsha on my ears. Is it us making that noise? Because it doesn't suit our character. It's kind of gross. Okay, QTEs are definitely easier with a um, <laughs> what they call controller. Whee! Whoa! Where are we going? Ooh, that looks like a hand. It's like. I don't like that. Probably not meant to be a hand, but that's what it looks like. Baron and I Edward disapprove. Von of course, I remember reading about this tragic expedition at school. We were taught he had died a hero's death out on the icy wastes, searching for Sanikovland. Yet, what if? What if? In doing so, he had sailed accidentally into the interior, deep below the crust of the world. That's a cool. fellow citizen of the surface. I had to try and find him. Oh, big stretch. Is he gonna try and kill us? I feel like he's gonna try and kill us. But that's fine, you know? Many things have tried to kill us so far. And we are not yet dead. Mean. I love Ivan's stun. Explorer stole my bow. Not dead, General, but quite insane. Perhaps it was the loss of the arm or the leg, or the long years in isolation. But Toll was clearly mad. You should have got along perfectly. That's that stash, though. But no, whatever okay. Toll's intention with little Orpheus was, I had no time to consider it. He was in mortal peril once more. We're just really good at nearly dying, but not quite dying. And honestly, I think that's quite relatable to my real life as well. What a jump. Convenient.
into the light. So, you believe that Thor had somehow enslaved the Mienkiv and bent them to his will? I do, General. Yes. It was obvious. Obviously. Why else would they serve him? And how else could they be so different from their free comrades? These odd helmets they wore, it was the science of our times, no doubt about it. Although fused with some strange crystal technology I could not recognize. To be honest with you, it didn't seem appropriate to stop and ask them. Valid point. I probably would stop and ask them and then I would die. But at least I'd have answers. They probably wouldn't give me answers before killing me. Hello, friend. Hello. Whoa. I'm tempted to try and play this game without any glasses on because I think that would be hilarious. But also <laughs> stressful. <laughs> So a madman built all of this. Is that what we're saying? Or did the Menkf build it and then the madman just took over? I'm confused. It's okay. I'm not here to be smart. I'm here to look pretty and play pretty things. This though, you say he was an explorer? Yes, General, he was. He vanished some 60 years ago. I remember the story well. And you say he stole little Orphan? To get home, General. To get home. I think he must have thought he could use the atomic bomb to blast his way back to the surface. And that was just <laughs> stupid, obviously. <laughs> Brilliant, Ivan Ivanovich! And you expect me to believe that a hundred-year-old madman not only survived below the Earth's crust, but enslaved this Mienkiv? Explored the lost worlds and discovered the secrets of atomic power all by himself. A czarist yes. general. An imperialist. No doubt harking back to the terrible days before the Great Revolution. And Estonian. Estonian. Estonian, Estonian, Estonian. general. They are wily people. Exactly. That's what I said. Bonk. See, I would be terrible in a survivalist situation because I would probably just fall and die. Um, but also, I can't. I have no upper body strength. I wouldn't be able to like pull myself up a rope or anything. But it's fine, you know. I don't mind. Stretched away into the distance, and I sometimes wondered if I would ever find my way out. But I never gave up, Jim. Spoilers. Of course. We find our way out. Hero. No, General. No, 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 no. I am no hero. I am a simple toy maker's son from Tomsk. Omsk, General. Omsk. You said Tomsk. I said Omsk. You said Tomsk. General, I think I am well aware of the city of my birth. Perhaps all the moving around as a child confused you. I am very easily confused. <laughs> You're not at all suspicious. He was like, oh, I can see a thing moving, but whatever. I'm sure it's fine. Goodbye, friend. I hope to see you again soon. Um, how, how? Hello. I have questions. Do I need to like pull it? But I don't understand how that will keep me safe. I was not meant to go woo off the side. I was just meant to be like plonk. Uh -huh. 
Goodbye. Goodbye. You can't see me. No, you can't. F*** you. F*** you. I would never saw it. I don't know. I do not understand what you want from me. What do you want from me? Maybe I need to go down? You seem broken. Um, so I'm just going to leave you to it. Itchy. Uppity or downity? Uppity. Nailed it. I knew that instantly. Didn't make one single mistake. Didn't die once. I have no idea what you're talking about. None. Across the <laughs> deserted, frozen plateau. I'm single-handed in my pursuit, dogged in my determination. <laughs> I would take back little Orpheus and prevent Toll from detonating <laughs> the bomb. Ah, you are as humble as ever, Tavari. Well, General, you are a great military leader, a great strategist, whereas I am simply the humble son of a watch toy, a toy maker, <laughs> and driven by patriotic fever with no regard for my own safety. I rushed blindly. Why are we getting such simple things about me wrong? That's sus. I'm loving being a snowball, though. It makes travel so convenient. Cutscene. I'm not pressing any buttons, so. Oh no! Our poor Wallace friend! Oh, we have a helmet on. Uh oh. Non Gucci. <laughs> Me on a night out. <laughs> How is it like small on our head? Will our courageous yet unfortunate hero drown? in the depths of an inhospitable frozen sea. Probably. Will he thaw out in time to prevent Tall from detonating the bomb? Will the general holiday in Omsk next year? Or Tomsk? <laughs> or perhaps both? What exactly is the difference between a mammoth and a Good elephant? question. All of these questions and more should almost certainly be answered in the next exciting episode of Little Orpheus. There we go. Achievement unlocked, Hairy Elephants of Omsk. <laughs>